Hi everyone, welcome back to Rita Roo. My name is Miss Christy, and today we're going to read Rappy the Raptor by Dan Gutman, illustrated by Tim Bowers. Let's get started. Rappy the Raptor by Dan Gutman, illustrated by Tim Bowers. I'm Rappy the Raptor, and I'd like to say, I may not talk in the usual way. I'm rhyming and rapping all of the time. I'm talking when I'm walking, and I'm rhyming when I climb. I'm rapping at my school, and I'm rapping with my peeps. Sometimes they even tell me that I'm rapping in my sleep. Now, how did it happen that I started rapping? Well, here's my story in all its glory. I was born in a tree back in Memphis, Tennessee. My mom, that's Mappy, and my dad, that's Pappy, took one look at me and got oh so happy. When I popped from my egg hip hopping on my leg, I tried to fly, I don't know why, but the next thing I knew, I was falling from the sky. I landed on a shed and I smacked my head. I turned all red, I had to go to bed. But here's the big surprise when I opened my eyes. I was feeling just fine and I was talking in rhyme. I'm Rappy the Raptor and I'd like to say, I may not talk in the usual way. I'm rapping in the morning, I'm rapping at noon, I'm rapping in October and I'm rapping in June. My parents freaked out. They didn't know what to do. Should they take me to the doctor or take me to the zoo? They rushed me to the hospital. The ambulance was screaming. The nurse gave me a popsicle. I thought that I was dreaming. The doctors looked me in the eye and looked me in the ear. And I'm not ashamed to say they even looked me in the rear. Next, they put me in a box. They took pictures of my guts. It made a bunch of noises. I thought I would go nuts. They scanned my lung, they poked my nose, they scraped my tongue, they yanked my toes. But they couldn't figure out what happened. Nobody knew why I was rapping. I'm Rappy the Raptor and I'd like to say, I may not talk in the usual way. I'm rapping in the morning, I'm rapping at noon, I'm rapping with the doctors, I want to go home soon. They took me to a lab, hooked me up to weird machines. They ran all kinds of tests and watched computer screens. They made me look at dots. I had to pee in pots. Some guy gave me a shot. They didn't feel too hot. After doing all those tests, they told me to get dressed. I was expecting the worst. I thought that I would burst. The doctor stood up and put down his coffee cup. His name was Dr. Ted, and this is what he said. After much confusion, we have come to our conclusion. There's no need to be formal, Rappy's perfectly normal. He's A-OK, -okay. that's what we want to say. Don't blame it on the fall, he was born this way. Then the doctors started bopping, their fingers started snapping, the nurses started hopping, and I started rapping. I'm Rappy the Raptor, and I'd like to say, I may not talk in the usual way. I'm rhyming and rapping all of the time. I'm rapping when I'm writing, and I'm rhyming when I climb. I'm rapping in the playground, I'm rapping at the zoo, I'm rapping on the sidewalk, and now I'm rapping with you. This book was so great. I loved all the rhyming words 
And I love that he even tried to go to the doctor to stop rapping. But really, that's just who he is. It's fun to be who you really are, no matter what. I loved reading with you today, and I hope we can read together again soon. We can do that if you click on the subscribe link below. Then you'll get a notification every time we post a new story to read. If you'd like to do some fun activities with us, you can come over to readaroukids.com, the link is below. There we'll be able to cook together, craft, do puzzles, and even do some science experiments. I'd love to see you again soon. Until then, you can follow us on our social medias at Readaroo Kids. Have a great day, and Readaroo loves you. Bye-bye.